hello everyone welcome back today i came with a beautiful motif pattern look at this heart shape in it it's so cute and super easy to make thank you for watching and let's get started for this project i'm using three colors of cotton yarn but you can use a solid color and 2.5 millimeter crochet hook first i'm taking my pink color yarn and i'm going to work a magic circle like this i'm just simply wrap around on my finger and putting the back strand through the first one and then i'm making a chain one to secure the magic circle now i'm taking my finger out and then you can see here is a ring from now on we're going to work into this ring so now we're going to work eight single crochets into the same space here into this ring okay here we made eight single crochets now we're going to pull this little strand and finish this magic circle and tucked it now i'm going to insert the hook from the first single crochet here and then make a slip stitch okay here we've done our first round now let's move to the second round for that work chain three this chain three counting as our first double crochet from the two double crochet cluster so now i'm going to work a double crochet into the same space here okay here we done this is counting as our first two double crochet cluster now from your work chain two and in the next chain space here we're going to work a two double crochet cluster so for that start to work a double crochet now yarn now pull through two now we have two loops on our hook don't finish it Again, start to work another double crochet and pull through two like this. So now here you can see we have three loops on our hook. Now again, yarn over, pull through from all the loops. So here we made two double crochet cluster. Now from here, work chain two. And in the next chain space, work a two double crochet cluster. All you have to do is just continue the same pattern, making two double crochet clusters in each chain spaces till the end. And don't forget to make chain 2 in between of 2 double crochet clusters. Okay, here we reach the end of this round. Now last work chain 2 and then I'm going to make a slip stitch. So I'm going to insert the hook from this first double crochet, not from this chain 3. And top of this double crochet, we're going to insert the hook and then work a slip stitch like this. So this is how it looks like our second round. To move to the next round, we have to cut off the yarn so for that chain one and then cut off the yarn okay here we done now we're going to start the third round so for that i'm taking my light purple color yarn and then make a slip knot like this now grab the project and i'm going to insert the hook from this chain two space here now grab the yarn and then make a slip stitch now in this round we're going to work treble crochet clusters so for that we have to work chain four so this chain four counting as our first treble crochet cluster from three treble crochet clusters okay now from here yarn over twice and start to work a treble crochet so grab the yarn and yarn over pull through two loops and again yarn over pull through two loops so here we have two loops on our hook now again yarn over two times start to work another treble crochet grab the yarn and yarn over pull through two loops and again yarn over pull through two loops so now we have three loops on our hook now yarn over and pull through from all the loops so here we made a three treble crochet cluster now from here work chain three now again i'm going to work a three treble crochet cluster into the same space so for that yarn over twice and start to work a treble crochet but don't finish it now we have two loops on our hook now again yarn over twice and start to work another treble crochet but don't finish it okay now we have three loops on our hook now again start to work another treble crochet into the same space but don't finish it
okay here you can see we have four loops on our hook now we are now and pull through from all the loops all the four loops so here we made our three treble crochet cluster now again from here we'll chain three now again into the next chain space here we're going to work two three treble crochet clusters so for that start to work a treble crochet but don't finish it now we have two loops on a hook again start to work another treble crochet into the same space yana yeah, will pull through two and again yana yeah, will pull through two so here we have three loops on a hook now again start to work the last treble crochet but don't finish it now last you should have four loops on your hook so last yana yeah, and pull through from all the loops now from here we'll chain three and work another three treble crochet cluster into the same space all you have to do is just continue making two clusters in each chain two spaces okay here we reach the end of this round our last work chain three and then i'm going to enter the hook from the middle top of double crochet here you can see we have two double crochets and four chains so we're going to insert the hook from this first double crochet top of double crochet here and then make a slip stitch so here we made our third round now chain one and then cut off the yarn to start the fourth round i'm taking my white color yarn and then make a slip knot now grab the project i'm going to enter the hook from a space that between of two treble crochet clusters here so i'm going to enter the hook from this chain three space here and then make a slip stitch now from here work chain three and this chain three counting as our first double crochet now work four double crochets into the same space so with that chain three total you should have five double crochets okay here we made four double crochets and total you should have five double crochets now from your work chain two and then i'm going to enter the hook from this chain three space you can see in between of these cluster sets here work a single crochet now from here work chain two and again i'm going to work five double crochets in the next chain three space here you should work five double crochets in between of these two clusters okay here we made five double crochets now from here work chain two and then skip into next chain three space this one and work a single crochet like this all you have to do is just continue the same pattern till the end okay here we reach the end of this round our last work chain two and then insert the hook from the third chain from the first chain three here and then work a slip stitch so here we done our fourth round now let's start the fifth round so for that work chain three this chain three counting as our first double crochet in this round we're going to increase so i'm going to work one double crochet into the same space here now into the next chain space work one double crochet now again into the next chain space work one double crochet and again into the next one work another double crochet now here into the last one work two double crochets okay here we done you can see we increased to the first one and to the last stitch so now from here work chain two and we're going to work top of these five double crochets so like previous one we had to increase to the first one and the last stitch so to the first stitch i'm going to work two double crochets now into next three stitches we're going to work one double crochet in each
Now into this last one we're going to work two double crochets. Now from your work chain 2 and skip into this chain 5 space and continue work the same as before and continue the same pattern till the end of this round. Okay here we reach to the end of this round or last work chain 3 and then insert the hook from the third chain from the first chain 3 and then work a slip stitch. Okay here we done our fifth round. Now let's move to the sixth round. Now from here work chain 3, this chain 3 counting as our first double crochet and I'm going to work one double crochet into the same space here. Now work one double crochet into the next chain space. Again into the next chain space work one double crochet and again into the next one work one double crochet and continue two more times to the next two stitches work one double crochet in each so now this is the last stitch into this last stitch we're going to increase so work two double crochets into the same space so total you should have nine double crochets now from here work chain one and then skip into the next space here here also we're going to increase in first and to the last one so into the hook from the first chain space and work two double crochets now into next five spaces work one double crochet in each okay now into this last one work two double crochets so total you should have nine double crochets now from your work chain one and then into the next one work the same increase into the first one and the last one all you have to do is just continue the same pattern till the end of this round okay here we reach to the end of this round our last work chain one and then insert the hook from the third chain from the first chain three and then work a slip stitch so here we made our sixth round and this is how it looks like now let's move to the last round so in this round we have to create a heart shape so we have to make two half circles top of this so for that i'm going to skip into the next space here work a slip stitch and again into the next chain space work a slip stitch now from here work chain three and this chain three counting as our first double crochet now I'm going to work six double crochets into this same space. So total you should have seven double crochets. Okay, here we made six double crochets and with that chain three you should have seven double crochets. Now skip one chain space and into the next chain space here we're going to work a single crochet. So here we made our first half circle. Now let's work the second one. So for that skip one space and into the next one we're going to work seven double crochets into the same space. okay here we made seven double crochets now skip this two stitches skip this two single crochets and then i'm going to work a single crochet into this chain one space here oh so this is how it looks like we created a heart shape now let's work to the next one so skip these two chain spaces and into the third one we're going to work seven double crochets into the same space
okay here we are done now skip one chain space and into the next one work a single crochet now again skip one chain space and into the next one we're going to work seven double crochets here okay here we met now skip these two spaces and into this chain one space i'm going to work a single crochet like this so you can see we created a heart shape so all you have to do is just continue the same pattern till the end of this round okay here we reach the end of this round or last work a single crochet to this chain one space and then i'm going to work a slip stitch the same time i'm going to work a slip stitch so insert the hook from the third chain from the first chain three and then work a slip stitch now from here work chain one and then cut off the yarn so here we made our beautiful heart motif pattern and this is how it looks like look at that beautiful heart in this motif I hope you love this video. If you like, give a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. See you soon with another beautiful tutorial. Until then, take care. Bye bye.